Hello and welcome. This is class number 54 of the UPSC Mains Answering Initiative, a place where every evening at 7 p.m. we decode a previous year question from the various papers that have been given by the UPSC in the past. Try and discuss that topic, write an answer, and then also give your homework in the end for you to test out your skills in answer writing. In order to further help you in answer writing, I've launched a new initiative called the Mastering UPSC Mains Answering Program. A lot of you have already joined in, and the initiative has started for those who are planning a 2024 attempt for those who are planning the attempt in 25 or later this is a personal mentorship program specifically focused on making you a master of upsc mains answer writing it's a one on one course where i will be guiding you giving you weekly targets giving you weekly tests and then having interaction with you every single week evaluating the copies that you wrote and then having a discussion on how can you be better the progress that you are making in order to get any details about this if you have any question i have given here my contact number and the email id feel free to mail whatsapp or call whatever you are comfortable with before we begin today's class once again a reminder that i always give you if you are new here if this is your very first class of this series do a couple of things number one hit the subscribe button right away number two if you are new here and you are completely absent-minded about how to start writing an answer I would highly recommend you go to a description of the video over there i have given the link of this entire playlist in the link of the playlist go to class number one in the very first class we have discussed about how to write the introduction the main body the conclusion what to include what not to include all these things are given in that particular video so do watch that to get a lot more clarity about how to begin answer writing once you're done with that <clears throat> we can begin then the question that we are taking up today is from internal security a gs3 question that the upsc had asked in 2022 the question was discuss the types of organized crimes describe the linkages between terrorists and organized crimes that exist at national and transnational level so there are a couple of things that are asked first they are asking you what are the different types of organized crimes now there are main types of organized crimes terrorism there is uh, money laundering there is hawala transactions there is cyber crimes, all that is organized crime. Organized crime basically is a crime syndicate or a crime that works through a proper enterprise where they have a proper structure, they do proper planning and that is when an organization carries out these attacks. These are called organized crimes. And then we have to discuss linkages between terrorists and these organized crimes at national level and at transnational level as well. To begin, you would very easily be able to give definition of organized crime that would be the perfect introduction so that you can begin the answer by telling the examiner that you know what exactly is an organized crime so we'll give an introduction by saying organized crime is a category of transnational national local grouping of highly centralized enterprise run by criminals to engage in illegal activity so this is simple plain common definition if you think you have some other definition in your mind you can go ahead see this is not a school examination so definitions need not be remembered you don't have to write a word to word same definition as is given in some other book you have to write from your own mind from your own understanding so whatever your understanding of organized crime is you have to put that into words and write the introduction here that it is a category of transnational local groupings of highly centralized enterprise they are run by criminals now the questions first part was the different types of organized crimes so there are many examples that you can give drug trafficking India has been impacted by it because of its geographical location. We are in the middle of Golden Crescent and the Golden uh, Triangle. Because of that, we are stuck between two drug producing and drug consuming areas, which is why both of our borders towards eastern and the western sides are susceptible to drug trade. Then the Hawala transactions, illegal transfer of money. You have, you would have read about the famous Hawala cases in India. There was this very famous Supreme Court case also called the Vineet Narayan case of 1997. It was related to the Hawala transactions where the Supreme Court gave guidelines about the working about the CBI. Cyber crimes that have increased these days. Human trafficking has always been a major component of organized crime and money laundering as well as happens across the entire world. Now, this is not the only list. This is not an exhaustive list. If you want, you can add others as well, depending upon whichever examples you remember at that point of time. The next part of the question was linkage between organized crime and terrorism. Now, 
some people might get confused about what to write in linkage or how to write the linkage basically what the question is how is terrorism related to these for example drug trafficking leads to generation of money that is used by terrorists hawala transactions are used by terrorists to fund their operations to buy weapons so these are the kind of linkages that we are talking about so in order to enhance the organizational infrastructure a lot of money is being used or a lot of money is earned by the terrorist organizations using smuggling kidnapping etc look at afghanistan the major source of revenue for taliban also for example right now is the illegal drug trade they don't really have any other source of income right now so terrorism or these violent activities need certain sponsor look at naxalism for example the naxal activities in india how do they get money to buy weapons to have their sustenance one way in which they get money is they get support from countries such as china pakistan or adversaries of india apart from that they also have captured certain mineral mines and they illegally extract minerals they illegally mine the minerals and they sell those that is again a connection between terrorism and these kind of activities these help the terrorist organization expand their reach as well the help terrorists with improved access to resources as i told you take example of isi that is pakistan secret service they have been helping terrorists with smuggling of arms explosives etc so again there is not a fixed number of examples that you have to give here depending upon whatever you rem remember at that point of time try and give these examples then we'll conclude by just writing a summarized version of a line that is to counter terrorism our focus should be on ensuring that resources being used by terrorists or all these activities that are helping the terrorists should be curtailed as much as possible so in order to put a full stop to terrorism we have to first ensure that these organized crimes are stopped in some way or the other and for that we need international collaboration going forward something like this can be the concluding argument and now it is time for you to write an answer question for you is while more women are entering the workforce they remain underrepresented in leadership positions discuss the obstacles women face in the workplace that contribute to this disparity write in about 200 words if you want i'll be happy to evaluate that in a couple of days or 3 days maximum you can mail your answers here again do give attention and do think about joining that means answer writing course i also have prepared a booklet of 101 model essays to help you prepare better for the essays in order to get the psir course or the essay booklet or any of these courses that i am launching you can always contact me on this given email id i am also giving the link of my android app the link is in description of the video do download that app as well to all see all the other offerings that i have for you thank you so much bye bye jai hind